Hey guys, Jimmy Vegas here, and I'm going to show you a real quick, cool, simple way of overlaying an image on top of your game, as well as post-processing to give it an extra bit of effect. Now, I'm going to use this image right here, and obviously you can use absolutely any image at all, but it's all down to what the alpha is. So, if we go to Game Object, and then create UI and Raw Image, if we go to the anchoring position up here and we select this one right here, which is stretch both horizontally and vertically, set the left, top, right and bottom all as zero, it will stretch this image all the way across the screen. You just need to drag and drop that image over here onto that texture. If we press play now, we won't get the desired effect just yet. However, if we go to color here, select and then change the alpha that is how we can get that desired effect within your game so whether you want it completely opaque which probably not or completely transparent there's no point any alpha in between gives that effect right there so we can see if i just rotate the camera a little bit that image effect stays with the screen now, that is a really cool image effect that you can use without post-processing. And in some ways, it probably adds just a little bit more to the game. You could always add a bit of animation to it. You could always add something else to it. You could have two images layered on top of each other. If I duplicate that image, you could see, yes, it gets more intense, that imagery, but that could also be a second image that you could have. There's, there's no end to it. So I find this quite useful for certain games of certain genres. If you want to give a game a bit of an old retro kind of look, it's worth attaching something like this image style over the top using the raw image in your canvas. So guys, that's how you can attach an image to give a different type of effect on your game without actually using post-processing. So I hope that's helped a little bit and I hope you can use that to some degree in your game. I've seen it asked quite a little bit and it, it, I've just shown you how easy it actually is. Things in Unity aren't that difficult and that's one of the easier things. So don't forget, click the subscribe button and click the bell icon as well. Stay up to date with every tutorial on my channel. And guys, yep, yeah, thank you very much for watching this short tutorial.